According to the report reaching us right now, veteran Nigerian comic actor Babatunde Omidino, fondly referred to as Babasuwe, is dead. This is someone who has entertained a lot of people. A lot of people grew up knowing Babasude, Babasuwe, um, while people who were friends of Babasuwe, um, they've said several good things about him. The news of his death was confirmed by the president of the Theatre Arts and Motion Picture Producers Association of Nigeria, Bolaji Amuson, also known as Baba Latin. It was gathered that the actor died today, 22nd of November, 2021. In an exclusive interview with the Punch newspaper, Mr. Latin said it has been confirmed that Babasue is dead. I just got off the phone with his son who confirmed that the actor is dead. I don't have much details about his death. Babasue, born on August 22nd, 1958, in Inabere Street on Lagos Island, where he grew up, but hails from Ikorodu local government area of Lagos State. Omidino had his primary education at Jamatul Ismail Primary School in Lagos and Children Boarding School, Oshogbo, before he proceeded to Adikombe Commercial High School in Mile 12, Lagos. He obtained the West African School Certificate from Ifeolua Grammar School in Oshogbo, the capital of Oshun State, southwestern Nigeria. Omidina began acting in 1971, but became um, known, came into limelight after he featured in a movie titled Omo Lasson, a film produced by, a, by Obalende. It became more popular after he featured in Iru Esi, um, produced by Olai Igwe in 1997. He had also featured in and produced several Nigerian movies, such as Baba. Jai Jai, a movie that featured Funke, Akindele, and Femi Adebayo. In 2011, that is the beginning, at least from what we know, it might have been, you know, having this health issue. A lot of people have problems, health issues that are not known by them or even made public. They might be looking for, um, you know, traditional ways to, for, for, um, traditional or orthodox way ways of getting themselves better um, these things do happen but um, something happened 2011 Baba Sugwe was accused of trafficking drugs cocaine prohibited drugs cocaine by the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency that is the beginning of Baba Sugwe's downfall both health wise um he claims that certain probes were put inside of him anus i don't know how true that is and um, they claim that their machine their machine that is the claim although we've not seen evidences of this being put out there they claim that their machine they have the x-ray machine at the airport the nda la they have machines to see into the internal organs of people and they did, according to them, try to get their machines to do what it needs to do. They claim that their machines saw drugs, pellets of drugs, swallowed by Babasue on his way to Europe for one of his show, MC shows there. But they couldn't get that drug off from the body of Babasue. That is what it is. So they had to keep Babasue um, detained for some time. And of course, you know, when someone has this inside of his body there is always a possibility of um, some uh, um, things happening to the person probably if there is a bust a leak of that drug in the body of the person this could create some um, unnecessary in fact could create dangerous situation and the person could end up dying overdose of that inside of the body of the person but what is the mystery that surrounds all of this baba sue claim that he has nothing inside of him he said Certain people who are against his progress call the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency or give an hint. People who are hell bent on making sure they bring him down, envious people, they set him up. That is just what it is. And some people are saying the people that he took the drugs for, he claimed that he didn't deliver this and all of that. You know, all of these stories that surround um, drug trafficking. But the point is this 
he claimed that he did not carry any drugs. So the machine that scanned Babasue and found drugs inside of him, they had the X-ray machine that found drugs, pellets of drugs. They saw the pellets according to them. But Babasue could not uh, excrete out, could not pass out these so-called alleged drugs that he claimed that he has inside of him. So all of these together, you know, kind of create a situation whereby, you know, um, you know, it, Babasu had to take the NDLA to the court and he claimed that he won somehow. But the lawyer, that is another mystery again. The lawyer died. The lawyer defending Babasu Wei died during the course of this whole investigation and going to the court and all of that. So he said if that man did not die, he would have won that money that he was supposed to be paid for all of the um, troubles that the NDLA gave to him. So he talked about probes and all of these things and who knows, somehow Babasue has never, it, it didn't come out well after that period. We don't know what happened. We don't know if they had to spiritually call out that um, drugs out of him. That is if he actually carried it, if they called the thing out of his body. Um, I don't know. Maybe that is what brought about his um, issue, health issue. I don't know. Now, there is a woman who is the um, Kerubian Serafu, uh, one of the top clerics in Kerubian Serafu. Recently, she got a church. She's called uh, Mama Esther. Esther Ajayi, Mommy Esther Ajayi. She reached out to Babasue, and from what we heard, about 10 million naira was given to Babasue. He traveled abroad and all of that. But till now, till date, Babasue, you know, had to just die. You know, nothing came out good from all of this. Well, the allegation that was described as false and defamatory by the ruling um, Lagos State High Court that ruled, um, the solicitor, like I said, Bamidela Turu, Nigerian lawyer activist, um, passed away. So that is just the end of it. So, you know, it's just unfortunate that um, this man who has brought um, a lot of, you know, happiness, joy, entertained a lot of people, just had to go that way. It's so sad. So that's just what is it. Veteran, Nigerian comic actor, Babatunde Omidino, fondly referred to as Babasue, is dead. And this time around, it's not a rumor. It is um, all over the place. You know, you know, reputable platforms, uh, media houses, they carried out, they carried this news. They, 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 the news is just there. Nigerian comedy legend, Babasue, is dead. It is not a joke. Babasue is dead. It's on BBC. It's just on every platform. There's no story about this. There's no trick about this. It's not a rumor. Babasue finally passed away as a result of health issues.